2016 is almost over. Since today is the final day of 2016, thank goodness, I wanted to make a video kind of summing up what I learned this year. Last year, at the beginning of 2016, I dubbed 2016 the year of Lindsay, and I kind of just wanted to explore who I am as Lindsay and what I wanted as my own person. And it was really cool. I did a lot of really cool things. I did a lot of new things. I did a lot of things that I never thought that I would do, and they all turned out pretty well. But I think this year was a good jumping off point and a really good start of just figuring out who I am as a person. On to some things that I learned from 2016. I don't have to always agree with what other people think or feel. I am allowed my own opinion. I am the only person who has a say slash power over what I do with my body and with my mind. My pain tolerance has risen. Communication is key to any relationship. I have learned the art of saying no. Whether it be quitting jobs, leaving groups, saying no to activities, or saying no to shows or parts or anything in life. If you don't feel comfortable with it, if it's not something you're passionate about, or if it just isn't a good fit, it's okay to say no, and it's okay to quit. Something else will come along. Follow your gut. Take risks. Hair grows back. If you like the way you look, be it your clothes, your hairstyle, your makeup, anything, then that's all that matters. Get your car registration taken care of as soon as you get the little envelope in the mail. I learned the hard way. Being vulnerable isn't a bad thing. It's okay to cry. Stand up for what you believe in. Try new things. If you don't like something, say it. Don't let people take advantage of your time or your talents. Working out can be fun, I promise. Create things that you are passionate about. Camping out in the living room is great. Puppies continue to be the best medicine for anything that might be wrong. Florida is still the worst. Sorry, Floridians. When walking outside, keep a firm grip on your phone, or better yet, don't take it out of your purse, because, as I learned, someone might steal it right out of your hands. If you are involved in any type of show, or arts, or film, or theater, always be respectful and thank the crew, because they are the ones that make or break any project. Girls' nights are amazing and necessary. Be open to the feelings and opinions of others, even if you might not agree with them, at least hear them out. Don't be afraid to make choices for you. You are your own person. No one else can decide what you're going to do with your life. Always lock your doors, stay sexy, and don't get murdered. Read books. Actual, physical, hardcover books that you can turn the page and smell the paper and see the words in front of you. Sometimes things on screens aren't always better. Sing in the car. And finally, always remember that love is stronger than hate. I hope that 2016 had at least some good things for all of you, like it did for me, and I wish all of you a very happy and a very, very positive 2017. See you next year.